week's Buzz interview. I'm here with Jan Loveday, and she just wrote a book called Milliken College, and it is going to be published later this week, and I'm here to talk to her. Thank you for coming to the show. I'm glad to be here. Thank you. So for those of us who don't know about the book, can you tell us a little bit more? Okay, well basically it tells the story of Milligan's history um, in photos, basically with captions. The front of it does include a, a longer text that gives an overview and then throughout the rest of it is just old photos with captions that tell interesting tidbits. Awesome. How many photos would you say are in the book? Over 200. That is great. Um, when did you start writing the book and how did you become inspired to write it? Uh, it was about this time last year, actually, when uh, Dr. Jeans renounced, uh, announced his retirement. Um, I decided then that it would be a great time to be able to celebrate Milligan's history and to honor him and all that he has done for the college. And um, it had been a while since anyone had written a, a history for Milligan. And so did you just finish it? or? Uh, it was finished in the spring. Okay. It took me uh, about six months to get everything together, and then, of course, there have been uh, revisions, editing, and all that since then. That's great. Um, did you find anything shocking or surprising when you were doing your research? Well, Milligan's history is very interesting. Uh, I can't say that anything was particularly shocking, but certainly some intriguing information. Um, we have a lot of... Um, periods of time that were very difficult for Milligan. A lot of people made a lot of uh, personal sacrifices in order to keep the college afloat, and I think that speaks very highly of Milligan in terms of um, the dedication to the college. Of course, we have things like um, the Navy V-12 program during World War II. Uh, they trained officers. Um, we have some pretty interesting characters that came from Milligan. Um, we had a spy that a movie was made about, so there are several things in it that I think people will find interesting. Okay, and um, can you tell us a little bit more about how it became published? It's done through Arcadia Publishing. Uh, a lot of folks are probably familiar with the uh, little brown books that you find everywhere. Uh, it's typically a series. They do it about communities. Uh, this, of course, is part of the campus history series. So a lot of colleges and universities have gone through Arcadia to uh, publish a history like this. And um, it's, it's a pretty standard format, mm -hmm. so it's, it's not too difficult to do, and I enjoyed working with them. Awesome. And um, I understand that you're doing a book signing? I am. Homecoming? Yes, that's right. Um, Saturday morning, homecoming, uh, in the Gregory Center. Okay, that sounds great. And um, what about the, pro the proceeds go to? Yes, um, the proceeds will go to assist um, students in the early childhood education degree completion program. And um, lots of times they have tests that they have to take for licensing, and that's uh, sometimes a strain on those students who are coming back to school uh, at that time in their lives. And so what I wanted to do was to be able to help, to be able to assist in that way. It's my way of giving back. Well, that is great. Thank you so much for coming today. Um, Jan's book will be available October 3rd at the Milligan Bookstore or online at Amazon.com. Thanks again for coming, and back to you guys.